Hello everyone, welcome to my channel and today we're going to do something different. I'm going to talk about my four favorite facial oil and I'm going to talk about how to use them. Uh, the reason I'm doing this video because I notice many people don't know the small tricks uh, which I knew it and I hope you're all going to know uh, for oil to absorb better, to not stay on your face, to not feel greasy. So stay tuned and I'm going to show you exactly what you need to do and also show you my four favorites uh, oil, as I told you before, which I use it for a while and I keep buying them over and over. So if you don't know me, my name is Angelique. I like everything what's related to skincare, beauty, fashion. I also like a makeup, colorful makeup with a new touch. And I'm also a dance instructor who wants to dance and teach. And today we're going to talk about my favorite facial oils and how to use them. So stay tuned. Okay, the first things what you need to do is you need to use some kind of acid, in my case is glycolic acid from um, ordering, I and absolutely love it, 7%. It's helped me to deal with my agony if I, sometimes I have them. So what you do, you put a mount and you really clean your face. This is, I'm talking about after when you already clean your face with your, in my case, I do, double cleansing i do with oil and then i use the foaming one from derma e i also if you're interested i can put a link for you so i clean it very well in the shower and then after shower i also do that you i normally do that in, in the night and sometimes in the morning sometimes i skip sometimes i don't it depends but look my face was absolutely clean and i still have some in my uh, cotton so don't be fooled sometimes you think you really clean it everything but it's really not enough and this will help you to really clean and remove your dead skin and really clean it more uh, sophisticated i would say more deeper and especially if you have acne problem as well so after i like to use vitamin c in my routine a lot of it in different consistency some of them as a serum like a liquid um, clear like a basically like a gel of water i would say and another consistency i love uh, i have from my cure i talk about that vitamin c a lot is consistency like a lotion like a cream with fluoric acid so when i put all this in my case i just keep all this and i'm going to just use my absolutely favorite from dear my heel uh, moisturizing cream which i really love it and uh, it's give me a lot of moisture for my skin so i will do that this is i will do maybe after a um, couple of serums i put before that and that at the end if i feel like my skin needs really more moisture i will put this cream after um, when I have a lot of layers on my skin, I make them dry a little bit to observe. And then what I do today, I'm going to uh, use this oil, uh, Derma E with vitamin C glow facial oil with turmeric and Cibaxor. And also it has a lot, a lot of ingredients. I'm going to talk about this in a second about each oil. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to grab the oil, I'm going to place some drops on my face at my decollete. This is the other reason I put this top. And you see, I'm going to spread a little bit these drops just around my face like that without any kind of hard work. And then you have two options. Actually, you have three options. You can use one of your micellar water or you can use, I love to use uh, rose water as well. Or you can use a regular water, just uh, 
uh, make sure your hands, your fingers are wet and put it a regular water if you don't have some of these products. So today I'm going to use so a I'm going water. to spray where's my oil is and I'm going to massage just like this my oil and you can straight away feel that your oil with a consistency of this water missile of water become very light and it's really disappeared it's observed really really nicely and it doesn't stay on your first layer of your face this is the trick also what i like to do after just put my rose water because it has some smell of the rose and i will do the same thing and that's it that's the trick about oils and in the seconds i'm going to tell you all about oils i have as between why them and why i the reason i choose them and i really love them and keep using them you already see how I demonstrated how to use this oil, what to do, and now I'm going to talk about each of them, uh, why I really like them. So we're going to start with this uh, big boy, a radiant glow facial oil from Derma E, and this is oil is very beautiful oil. First of all, don't forget a 60 milligrams. If not in iHerb, you can buy it in whole uh, whole food uh, market. Uh, you can buy it in uh, some uh, websites. I'm going to place the links, which is a better price also. So this is, you need two, three drops, it's said. Basically, this is how it's consistency. I'm going to demonstrate each oil. Mm, I'm going to show you. Uh, this oil is doesn't have any scents. And uh, the consistency is a very light. All my oils is very uh, light oils. But again, to observe better, you need to spray, as I mentioned before, with a micellar water, with just the regular water. Or uh, in my case, it's a rose water, which I really, really also love it. I'm going to put a link about this guy. And I really, really love it. And when it's even hot or I feel like I want to more hydrate my face i just spray this all over even my makeup so let's talk about this oil this oil is has jojoba argan oil sibaxone oil and it has 60 milligrams so normally where i use this oil i use it uh, honestly i use it all the time because it has bigger amount 60 milligrams i use it even uh, like normally my all oils I use as the last step of my routine. I love it. It's a lightweight. I use it in the morning and in the night. Um, it depends. Sometimes I switch between this, the other oil. So if, for example, I do vitamin C, and if you, for example, think um, now it's too much sun and I don't want to use vitamin C in the morning, which I do it anyway, I just put a sunscreen and then I use my foundation, which has sunscreen as well. Uh, I think you still can use vitamin C in the uh, morning, even before you go, and it's a very uh, sunny and bright outside. Just use your sunscreen. And I will use this guy with my vitamin C to enhance my vitamin C because it has a vitamin C inside. And this is vitamin C glow face oil, and it has turmeric and sebaxone as well as a previous one. But this one guy has so much more. It's more concentrated. It's 30 milligrams. I'm going to go to my phone and exactly what it has. First of all, turmeric brightening your skin. Uh, Sebastian oil is antioxidant, uh, rich with superfoods. And this product, this ingredient has uh, my previous oil, but it's more uh, here and it has a lighter color as you see. And this guy has brighter color because of the turmeric. Also, it has red raspberry, cranberry, and ginger roots oil. It's more concentrated and it has a more brightening effect, I would say, than uh, this guy. But still, I really love this one as well. And um, some people who doesn't like a turmeric smell. So let uh, me demonstrate this oil. So as you see, it has a little bit a darker a brighter uh, 
yellow and it doesn't really smell that bad but maybe i get used to it it's really has turmeric a little bit of turmeric smell so if you can't stand turmeric smell then i will advise you to go with this oil but if you like turmeric so go with this one i really love both of them i will advise to use all of them to buy all of them and see look i just put it it feels amazing it has a little bit of turmeric a smell but i as mentioned before it's more concentrated let's move on let's go to another my favorite brand it's a cure also has a lot of uh great ingredients and nothing uh no paraben no uh, sulfate no nothing no nothing usda and it's organic it's approved so this is one of my favorite oil is marula oil so let's talk about marula oil so first of all marula oil this oils in a cure it's cold press oils and it's um marula oil is very good for also for your hair so you can use it drops and for your splits uh or to just hydrate your scalp a little bit it's also marula really oil good. is very good for even acne for a dry skin and aging skin and even oily skin it uh, also affect as uh, keeping hair soft uh, and moistures as i mentioned before uh this oil i really really love it it's amazing so when i do micro needling i really use uh this is is one of the oil i use because it's a really hydrate my skin so look, this is the oil, how it's look. It's absolutely white. It doesn't, it says a slight smell, but a very, maybe this is how my oil is smells. It's a very soft. I absolutely love it. Like uh, moisture your skin are uh, really, really good. I really love it. Mm, it's not it's very difficult to find actually marula oil so if you remember drunk elephant has a marula oil which everybody gets nuts about this marula oil it's very very expensive i would say much more expensive this this guy so if you can't really afford believe me this is a very very good product to try and a great quality so you can easily supplement with this oil and my last oil which i absolutely love it it's a seriously soothing oil so it's a uh, blue tansy rose normal to sensitive skin um what can i say this oil is a magic oil it really does what it said it's a soothing uh oil and when i do my micro needling i really put this oil and it's uh, do uh magic things for my skin also the skin uh, this oil good for people who has rosacea or sensitive skin or they have let's say even if you burn your skin like now as the sun is so intense this oil can really help you to soothe your skin to really um, moisturize your skin so this is something so this oil has a little bit of blue uh, light blue color and it also has a lightweight consistency, a very smooth and soothing, and it has a minty smell. That's the only things this oil has, it's a minty smell. So let me go more details with this oil because I'm doing the microneedling and this is the reason this oil I must have. So it says blue tansy and rose, it's USDF certified, approved, so it has also kale, argan oil, kukui oil, and yarrow. have no idea, but it has a lot of other ingredients. So what it does is soothing, hydrate your skin, um, and botanical ingredients proved. So that's it what is said basically, but in my experience, this is the one I really can live with and basically i can live with all of them uh, for example i really need this guy to boost my vitamin c when i use it with another serum this guy i need it really because it hydrates me very well and it's really beautiful it has kind of this 
it doesn't smell smell but it has just a natural smell this i needed my serious soothing when i do microneedling all just my skin irritated and this don't forget marula also have from agni and also you can use it for your hair and this guy i needed just when i do my makeup before i'm doing my makeup i want to hydrate my face better and i want to just spray it with my micellar water put these drops and really want my foundation look flawless i use this guy because i have 60 milligrams of this so i really need all my oils and i suggest you to try if you can try some of them or you can try one of them or maybe you need it because of uh, your uh, specific needs you are welcome to try and i really love them that's it what i want to share with you and share you small tricks how i use my facial oil and how i before i really didn't like oils uh, that's the reason was because they're too heavy because they didn't absorb on my face they stays on my skin they feel greasy nowadays these oils first of all they're white uh, uh lightweight and second of all we know now how to really use it in a even better way in a uh, more um i would say consuming way which you can really see how this oil works how they go more absorbed inside your skin and don't stay on your uh, surface and that's it for today thank you very much i hope it was very useful i hope you like my video if you really enjoy don't forget to subscribe and like it and see you soon bye bye